We've got a short little level one question here about percentages. A plasterer quotes £1,300 to plaster some rooms in a house. He has to add VAT at 20% to the quote. What is 20% of 1300 um, There are different ways of answering this question. There's different ways of doing percentage questions. Uh, I'm just going to pick uh, my favourite way. Um, now, my, my favourite way, the way I like to do percentages, is step one. You find one uh, percent of your number and step two multiply to find um, needed percentage you know so if it was uh, 81 percent times by 81 to find needed percentage okay so the number I'm starting with is 1300 and the question is what do I need to do to 1300 to find one percent well, this is 100%. This is the whole thing. So to find 1%, I divide that by 100. And I'll even make a note of that up here. You divide by 100. Good, good, good. So this answer will be 1%, which is 13. And I'm not after 1%, I'm after 20%. So what do I do to go from 1%, which is here, up to 20%? I need to times by 20. Like I said before, if it was 39%, I'd times by 39. But it's not, it's just 20. So 13, 1%, times by how many percents I need would be 260. So 20% of 1,300 is 260. Part B, show a check of your working. Whenever there's a question that needs you to do a check, I think it's always best to set out your answer box so that it's really easy to see where you're answering which parts of the question. So I know I'm checking it, it's a diff separate part of the question, so I'm separating it out to show the examiner where I'm doing my check. Uh, to do a check, in this case, I'm going to pick something I've done in here, some part of my working out, and do a reverse calculation to show that this uh, line of working out was correct. Uh, so let's pick that one, that line there. I'm going to start on my calculator with 260, my answer that I'm checking. And it was a times before, so I'm going to do a divide. If I divide by one of these two numbers, my answer should be the other one, because this is saying there are 13 20s or 20 13s in 260. So I'm just going to follow it backwards. I'm going to do 260 divided by 20, and my answer should be 13. Let's see. It is. Good. So I've checked that, that bit of working out, and my check shows that this was correct. So two marks for working out the percentage, and one mark for working out the calculation. The, the, one mark for checking your answer.